Hello, I'm Reed Yaden with the Jefferson County Fire Service, and joining me is Captain Travis Bell with the Pleasure Ridge Park Fire District. Now, in 2014, 66% of all flood deaths were because someone drove into flooded waters, in most cases, a completely preventable tragedy. Captain Bell, how many calls do you make every year for stalled vehicles that ventured into flooded roads? Four or five calls a year, uh, depending on the weather. A lot of people just try to uh, go around the flooded road signs and, and get to where they're going, and that usually ends up in a problem where their car gets washed off or gets submerged in water, and then we have to go rescue them. Now, if you can, give folks an idea of how much moving water it takes to really wash a vehicle away. Two inches of flooded water will move a normal car off the roadway. Uh, so you're talking four to 5,000 pounds, two inches of water will move that into the ditch, into the flooded creek, or, or under the bridge. Now, if someone gets caught in their vehicle, what should they do? Immediately call 911, give us as much information on location, uh, how many people are in the vehicle, and uh, what's going on. At that time, we'll respond and, uh, with the appropriate assets and uh, effect a rescue. Captain Bell, I'd like to thank you very much for that very, very good advice, and thank you for taking the time to join us. Now, if you don't have to be out during periods of heavy rain, don't do it. And by all means, if you have to slow down extremely because of water over the road, turn around and don't drown. For more safety tips, visit our website and follow us on Facebook and like us on Twitter and subscribe to us on YouTube, jeffcofire.com.